Bonjour to le monde, it is I, Reverend RX, and welcome back to more Super Mario Galaxy Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Last time we did most of the Beach Bowl Galaxy and then uh, took a look at Rosalina's storybook. And this time, we're still missing a star. Uh, I think you can do this in missions two or three. So what we want to do is we want to go grab a shell. Um, because there is, when I told you there's, you, like, the shells can open treasure chests, which we knew already. The, uh, there's another treasure chest we can open with it. So we're gonna go take care of that one now. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted you to do at all. So we want to take a shell out of the water here. I believe I can do it this way. We're going to climb around here. If we head all the way over here, there is this treasure chest here. Which inside has a launch star, and if we take it, we go to a planet we haven't even been to yet. Hey look! Mario 3 music with a Mario Sunshine enemy, a Cataquack! What we want to do is we want to learn the lure the cat a quack Cat a quack Over here. No, don't kill yourself. We need its uh, ability to throw us super high to grab this coin. In order to find a brand new power-up. The Ice Flower. So we can walk on water and skate on water. And we can wall jump up waterfalls. I don't know why my angle is so weird there. Okay, well, I failed that, so let's go grab another one, because it is timed. So let's head on back. Go up here. We'll jump more. And then, there we go. Now we're at the top. Now we need to combine what we learned between the Cag Quack and this, and lure this Cag Quack over to the star. And there we are! I don't even know what this mission's called, honestly. I, I didn't pay attention, I was too busy looking at something else. Oh well. All right, so now we have the ghostly galaxy. Which this galaxy is important for unlocking something. Luigi and the Haunted Mansion. You remember the Toad Brigade said they lost Luigi on the journey. How fitting he found his way into a haunted mansion. Yes. We detected signs of Luigi in this galaxy. I hope he hasn't been eaten by ghosts. All right, these spires you can actually spin into to break, and this one in particular has a rainbow scar. Which you can use to attack these uh, Jacko Goombas. And then the tar Tarantulas. And, of course, the uh, whatever those are called. Chain Chomp. 
And then we want to hit this switch to turn on the light. The light helps us kill boos. So we want to lure this boo, who we just saw has a key inside of it, into the light to kill it. And we get the key and it opens a door. So this music, I didn't realize this song actually came from this game. I first heard this song in Super Mario 3D World and fell in love with it. And then once I heard it, went back to this game, I realized it was from this game. I hadn't realized that before. But God, I love this ghost house theme. Be careful here. Those little black holes do kill you. But they just don't suck you in as aggressively. So with the Jackal Goombas, you hit them to break the, uh... Uh, pumping on their head. But otherwise, they just work like a normal Goomba. If you ground pound... They do spew out this fire as they walk around. But if you ground pound them, they just all break and die and become a coin. Is there anything on here? No. So it must be over here. Yeah, there it is. So this gives us a new launch star, I believe. I think actually, yeah, for, on top of the black hole, which you definitely, oh no, it does replace it, okay. So now we just need to grab the key to open the door. If you spin around the booze, they do spin around a little bit. Uh, this is written in Boo-ish. Didn't know booze had their own language. So we can grab this and find a Boo Mushroom to become Boo Mario. We can shake to vanish, and if you touch light, you lose the power up. Or previously press B to float. And you can disappear. You can disappear and go through things. I swear you can go through this. Maybe not. But we can float up here. Oh, okay. That's what it does. Then float back down to grab it. But we can go invisible to go through bars like this. And booze actually don't want to hurt us in this form. They fall in love with us. So you want, you saw Luigi there saying, eek a ghost. You want to destroy the boo form before coming over here and talking to him. He finally came. I got lost with the toad to his terrible, but I found a power star. So that makes up for it, right? Thank you, let's go home. <laughs> Welcome back. I can see your brother from here. I bet if you ask him, I bet if you ask him, I bet he'll help you search for power shirts. And I'm sure he has a lot to tell you, so you should go speak with him there in the garage. Bro, you're looking for power stars, right? Let me help. I might have... I think you might have missed one in the good egg galaxy. If I find it, I'll write you a letter. Keep your eyes peeled for one. So yeah, once we get a letter for him, we'll, uh... I'll show you what that all means. But for now, I'll meet you back in the kitchen. Oh, actually, let's talk to this red luma. I'm curious what he says. I've got a secret, but I'm not telling. It's the only Red Luma on the ship, I believe. A very spooky sprint. Oh, I forgot about this. This guy is more so the equivalent of, uh... This mission gives us the equivalent of Koopa the Quick. And Il Piantissimo. 
The brigade members haven't come back. What are they up to? We can see in here. It's glowing, so we have a monster. The other one still just had the rainbow star. So now, once we start here, it starts moving and showing us a path we can walk on. But it, the path only exists where it's sitting. So if we come over here and grab a key, I guess, okay, I might. So now, we can, oh, it's going backwards. We can go over here. It's kind of like a snake block from like Mario World, but not. I do need a coin. What's in this one? More star bits. We're almost to the end. Grab this. And then this starts going upward. It's a little bit different than everything else. Just start grabbing the keys as you go. I can hear a star. So yes, I I did I did the secret mission. Oh, why are we up here? Magger Splagger Mansion. You have a letter from Luigi. Bro, I've got a star, but now I can't get back. This picture shows where I am. Help me. Where is that place? It looks familiar, but then again, I'll give you this picture so you don't forget. To view the picture, press plus. And, uh... You can view the picture. So, yes. It doesn't tell you which galaxy it is, but, I mean, I know which galaxy that is. That's Gug Egg. Nope, that's, is that the name of the first galaxy? Yes. Dying on Piranha Missing is where he's at. So now I just uh, come on. Thanks. You came to save me again. I know I could count on you, bro. What the power star? Yeah, it's right here. I got it. Yeah. Hurry up and bring that power star back. So yeah, some of the galaxies were missing. Some of the missions were missing is um, all related to that. <clears throat> so now we just wait for another letter from him and I will meet you back at the kitchen. So now we have a very spooky sprint. Now I'm curious, since I haven't actually completed the mission, oh, I can skip it, nice. So let's see if I can figure out the correct way to go, because I'm going to be honest, I didn't mean to do the secret mission. I thought I was going the right way. Oh, there's pool stars there. Okay, I see. All these little planets that spew out star bits are really cute, honestly. 
Oh, there's a Tobra gang member. G -g -g ghost Yikes, this looks scary. Hehe, <laughs> so you're after it too? You'll have to race me for it. Hehe, <laughs> here we go. So yep, this is a pool star race, which is kind of weird, but it, it, it it's here. Careful, this meat is chewy and bounces you around. It's a very weird mission. Uh, I believe this is a short cut. Yeah. Uh, and then you have to get off a few times from the pool stars, but it shouldn't be too bad. Here it's a little dangerous because there's bombs, just don't hit the bombs. And then once you're done, go through the gate. Haha, <laughs> as I promised, take this. Yep, a very quick one. I'm pretty sure I know what's last. Beware of Boulder Geist. Yes. Luigi was kidnapped by the monster that lives there. Okay. I don't know if I knew that before. No, it's a different planet. Is it still... Yeah, it's still a rainbow star. Okay. And then when we're in here, it's a little bit different than before. Bombus. So yes, from this painting, we will get Bombus, who we can grab by shape... Them. I don't know why that didn't work. And they start spinning around us, but when they hit something, they will explode. And we can move them around, but if we hold on to them for too long, they actually come in and blow us up. We want them to blow up that statue so we can use the launch star. Oh. wonder what that was. Oh, this is a... Uh... Longer mission than I thought it was. Oh well. Okay, sure. I don't even know what happened. I'm glad I have a lot of lives. Okay, really? I don't even remember this planet, like, at all. <laughs> but it's sure going to leave an impression on me now, that's for sure. these sling pods here. So I wonder if you could get here without ever seeing a sling pod. I don't... No, you definitely could, because they weren't until mission three of uh, that one planet. Or galaxy. 
Oh, and now we have blue star chips. Up here we can pull star to the I don't know why you just kept moving along with the thing instead of like that I don't <clears throat> this planet So random and pointless. You just bounce around until you get to the launch star and then just ground pound. And there we go. And now we're finally at the boss. <clears throat> so this is Bouldergeist. Well, no, this is a glowing nothing. Here we are, Bouldergeist. So he's going to summon boulders and throw at you, and you want the black boulders. Because they will turn into bombos. And you grab them, and you hit him. You can also shoot a star bit at the uh, black ones to turn them into a bamboo. A little bit sooner than normal. He makes those stalag things come out of the ground, and then there's more bamboos, you have to break them open, and then hit him in the uvula with a bomb. Because Mario's such a kind being. And then he comes back after you do that once with hands. And with his hands, he's able to punch. But more annoyingly... They get in the way of the bombs. Usually, I was actually pretty good. Now he's gonna punch with his right hook. And there we go. It takes two hits to take out one of the hands, but they, he will reform them eventually. It's not a permanent destroy. And with that, we have taken out Bouldergeist. Alright, we're back in the dome, so with that... I'm going to call it off here. Next time on Super Mario 3D All-Star, Super Mario Galaxy, we will be taking on other small missions and probably one of the harder pranks or comments in the game. Au revoir!